All right, we got a 2004 F3 56 liter lost base oil pressure, which is low oil pressure. So I'm gonna do some checks on it real quick, and I'm gonna show you what happens. Okay, it just came underneath the truck on the passenger side. 12 millimeter Allen, see that? And that fitting right there. Pull that out. That's what I did, and I found this. It's a little piece. A snap ring. Most likely came off an injector. stopping the oil relief valve from closing all the way. Now once you've cleared out that debris, what you want to do is take a 3 8 extension. You want to come right down in here. And there's a plunger right back here. It's two o'clock position. Hold that down. While you use the power wire that goes directly to the starter. Connects right here. Take it off. Sometimes it gets hung up. You gotta reroute it and just push it right down on here like this while you're holding that plunger down. Let's see if it fills up. Boom, got oil pressure. So that's what you do. You disconnect the oil relief valve. If the spring's tight when you pull the cap off, it's probably hung up. That's how mine was. Pull that out, the spring first, then the piston, put a magnet in there, get the piston out. Then put a magnet in the hole, see if you get any debris, which is what I found. That was the problem. I'm still holding the plunger down on this. Relief valve works. End up, found, I found the wrong filter in it, it was too short. Got some debris in the oil relief piston. And that's what happened, I took it out, I got a little oil pressure back. Thanks.